Hello, this is Clayton Balmus, and I'm here today to share with you uh, some chemistry facts that I wanted to introduce you here today. And uh, in the solvent world and in the solvent industry, today we're going to share about the difference between petroleum based and bio based products to do the very same job of surface preparation. Well, let's talk about what people currently use. People currently use a product which is called MEK. Now I know this is a label, but it's called methyl ethyl ketone. It's a hazardous product and it's a solvent. I say, Clayton, I, I see a, a periodic table of elements. Is this a science class? Well, something like that. Because over here that you can see that we're talking about chemistry effectiveness. Why? You have a choice. You can when you want to have an application done. You can either choose a petroleum based product, you know, or a renewable resource which is from biorenewable sources which have, has oxygen within the DNA to do the same job. So for the next couple minutes we're going to be talking about these two types of product design and the, the advantages that they have. Okay? So here we go. What it is anytime that you choose to have something apply for the application. Now, we're talking here about um, solvents for surface preparation, aerospace level preparation. You have a choice, as I said before. You can either use chemistry, which is uh, carbon based, uh, lower uh, on, on the carbon scale, what we call C14, or you can choose products which are C12 from renewable resources such as plants, trees, uh, fruits, nuts, berries, many different things. And that is what Sparta Clean Biotechnologies is all about. Now we're talking about a product here called PrepSolve. Okay? Now PrepSolve was uh, developed here by Aeromotive Research and Development Group. It is a step one and a step two process, but this product here is what's called BioK technology. This is a preparation solvent. It has no MEK or acetone. It's an industrial surface cleaner. And for this application, it works with what we call our Surebond product, which we'll talk about later. This product here does the very same job, okay, as its MEK uh, brother, but counterpart, but it has see those leaves back there? That's for illustration. It has bio-based chemistry in it. Well, why is that, Clayton? Well, if they do the very same job, which they do, which we'll show in another video, what happens is if the chemistry gets onto your skin when it's an oxygen base um, in the DNA, when it gets into your skin or when you breathe it in, when, the, when you breathe it in the fumes, with it being bio-based, the body is much easier for it to disperse. Okay? So we have a choice. We either can use a bio-based product, which is much easier for the body with bio-K technology, such as the PrepSolve, or we can use the petroleum-based product, which is called methyl ethyl ketone, which uh, there's many studies on this and how it causes respiratory and in physical ailments, everything's short of carcinogenic. Why? All we care about is a chemistry that can be able to cleanse the surface. Now this happens to be a machine surface here on a torque converter piston. We want to be able to clean the surface for the preparation of what's to do. So we're looking for chemistry performance that's not going to hurt you. So I want to thank you for our time together and uh, we'll be getting into it a little more deeper. Bye now.